okay, so I've got number 20 here. It's a big box, but it doesn't feel very heavy. So let's have a look at what's inside. Are you ready, Baba? Let's have a look. Oh, I feel like they could have put that in a smaller box. <laughs> it is Sanctuary Spa Sleep Mist. Help you fall asleep faster and for longer. Nice, looks good. It smells like I'm reckon it's lavender again like the other thing presumably it's like a pillow spray um I'm not sure that is actually but it smells amazing doesn't actually say what's in it so but yeah it smells really nice it's yeah nice Hello and welcome back to Vlogmas. So I've got my little Christmas helper here um, and as you've seen by the title this is a what I got my husband for Christmas videos. This is all the stuff that I've got Fraser. Fraser if you're watching click off now because these are all your presents and you will be spoiled if you if you see this. So um, obviously if you're watching the children again I'm going to be uh, spoiling the whole Christmas magic, so switch off now. Um, but don't kick the presents, Baba. Oh, Baba. Okay, so um, so I've got him his presents that are from, are from Father Christmas, and then the presents that are just from me and Phoebe. Now, let me preface this by saying... Fraser wants for nothing. Like, when you ask him what he wants for his birthday or for Christmas, he is silent. He never knows what he wants. Um, every year it's a guessing game. You've just got to get him things that you think he's going to like. Um, and it's just been his birthday. His birthday was at the end of November. So I kind of used all my big presents then. Because I, for me, personally, like birthday's more for like big presents and stuff. Whereas Christmas is just for little bits. Um, so I used all my ideas for his birthday and then for Christmas I'm kind of really scraping the bottom of the barrel. But I think it, I think he's, I've got some stuff that he'll like. Um, so yes, let me get started then. So like I said, Fraser, last chance, click off now if you're watching. Don't spoil Christmas for yourself. Okay, so the first thing that I got him was this little tree charm. This is uh, Father Christmas from in his Father Christmas pal. And it's this little penguin. On the back it says patience, but that's not really why I bought it. It's just because it's a penguin. Um, it's from Accessorize. And he, I think penguins is like one of his favorite animals. Um, he really likes them. So I have got him this little penguin tree charm. Um, the next thing that I've got him, this is again just from Father Christmas, is this slab of Hotel Chocolat chocolate. Um, it, is plain milk and white because Fraser only likes plain chocolate. He doesn't like chocolate with anything in it at all. Um, he prefers plain stuff that's just chocolate. So yeah, it's just plain chocolate, but it's milk and white because he likes both of those. Okay, the next thing that Father Christmas is getting him is... Pardon? Pardon? You're interrupting, mummy is this bulldog face mask. So I thought this one was really cool because Fraser does face masks with me quite a lot, but he only does sheet masks because, I mean, I only do sheet masks really as well because we're both lazy and you can just take them off. Um, but these ones are really cool because they're obviously they're for men, whatever men's skincare means, but they're for men. Energizing sheet mask. There's eight masks in the pack and they're like little pellets. So you add water and then they like, <laughs> unfold and become a face mask which is just crazy um and then obviously he puts them on his face which i just thought was such a cool idea um so yeah paste press place a compressed sheet mask into the lid of the container soak it with the hydrator oh it just sounds like a bit of a laugh so i bought him these eight sheet masks then the last thing that father christmas is getting him is a back scratcher because he's obsessed with having his back scratched and this one i believe i haven't opened it and i bought it quite a while ago it's just off amazon but i believe it's in the shape of a bear paw which is just super cute don't throw your dummy around let's have a look yeah <laughs> oh 
so he can scratch his back with that rather than asking me to scratch his back all the time. So those are his four Father Christmas presents that will go into his stocking. Um, and then the rest of it is like from me and Phoebe. So the first thing that I got him is some more chocolate. Again, just plain because he only likes plain chocolate. Um, and again, a penguin because he likes penguins. Um, but it's this Jolly Penguin, which is a cosy hollow penguin wrapped in milk chocolate. So yeah, that's just from Hotel Chocolat. Then I got him this um, hair mask, which is by the brand Living Proof. It's a restore dry scalp treatment, just because he sometimes gets a bit of a dry scalp. So I got him that. Then I got him, he's really into like, um, or he likes to think he's into like cooking and stuff. Um, so I got him some fancy salt. Um, the first one I got him is this one. It's by the brand Zest and Zing. The first one is garlic and parsley, sea salt. So it looks like this. And then the second one, it's the same brand, but for some reason this one came in a little tub. Um, but this one is black lava sea salt. So it's like black salt. So he'll be, he'll be really into that. Uh, similar vein, I bought him three barbecue sauces for his birthday and of all the things that I bought him, all the amazing presents that people have bought him, he kept banging on about how amazing the sauces were. So I picked him up another two sauces that he's not tried before. Um, this one is Tangy Barbecue Sauce by The Condiment Company and this one is Recipe Number 78 Trackleman's Sticky Barbecue Sauce. So a tangy one and a sticky one that he can try. Next up I got him, this one's a bit of a joke present, um, if anyone has TikTok there was a brief trend of people buying their boyfriends or husbands or whatever, um, like a nighty, like a men's, it's like loungewear for men, but a nighty if that makes sense. Um, so I bought him this, which is just like a men's nighty basically. Um, and I have a feeling that we'll laugh about it, but he'll actually really like wearing it. So <laughs> we'll have to wait and see. It smells a bit funny, but it was just from Amazon, so maybe it'll need a wash before he uh, wears it. Okay, and there's two more things. Sorry, I'm not trying to rush, but obviously I've got Bubba, um, and I don't want to be too long because I've locked him out of the conservatory, so um, I didn't want to take too long. The next thing that I got was actually on his request. Um, it's a brand called Big Wild Thought, looks like that, um, and he told me that he liked the company, um, so he said, you go crazy and choose what you want. So like, he kind of showed me the website, but I chose it. Um, so it's basically a t-shirt on like jumper brand um, that they have an animal embroidered on their tops and that whatever animal you choose like money goes towards an, a conservation charity for that animal um so i chose one with a polar bear on uh, just a bit of information about polar bears basically so yeah that's pretty cool i'll wrap that with the t-shirt so you kind of can read the information and then you could also choose the color so i chose the color and the animal um and then i chose this kind of like rust color and it looks like all this and it's like I said, it's got the embroidery on it, so it's the polar bear. There were loads of different animals you could choose from, but I know he really likes bears, um, so he would want the money to go towards that. Um, so yeah, really happy with that. And then the final thing I've got him, which is like his biggest present price-wise, but it's probably the most boring, um, is some new pants, because he needs some new pants. Um, and they're the Calvin Klein, um ones they're just the trunks i guess what they're called and they're just the long fitting ones because that's what he likes um and they're just black with blue yellow and pink round on the letters so yeah that's everything that i got fraser for christmas obviously not loads because like i already said i already spent quite a bit on his birthday and that's when we kind of do our main presents 
Um, so they're just a little few bits to go under the tree. Um, but obviously if you're still shopping for your partner, I hope you've got some inspiration. And if not, I hope you have a wonderful Christmas and I will see you in tomorrow's video. Bye-bye.